Mix Master, Oil and Water. Here are some of the materials you will need for your first experiment. Water, food coloring, vegetable oil, and the printables that come with this lesson. Scientists usually work in a lab, and artists usually work in a studio, but they are both great at experimenting and being curious. How can science help you when you create art? Let's try an experiment. What happens when you mix water with food coloring? Add a few drops of food coloring to a jar of water and watch what happens. You may want to stir it after a minute. Did the water and food coloring mix together? Is any of the water still clear with no color? Use your experiment results sheet number one to record your observations. Food coloring is made out of water and color. When the colored water drops mix into the clear water drops, the two mix completely together. Green food coloring mixed with water made green water. Now let's try a second experiment. What happens when you mix water with oil? Pour some vegetable oil into a jar of water. What happens? Did the water and oil mix together? What happens if you try to stir the water and oil? Use your experiment results sheet number one to record your observations. Water and oil are two different materials that do not mix together. The oil drops all stay together and do not mix with the water drops. The water drops do not mix with the oil drops either. Now let's really mix it up. Add a drop of food coloring to your jar of water and oil. What happens? The red food coloring drop, which remember is made out of water, does not mix with the oil. But when the colorful drop sinks out of the oil and reaches the clear water, it mixes with the water to make red water. Oil and water do not mix. Now it's time to take our science experiments into the art studio. Here are some of the materials you will need for your art experiment. Paper, paintbrush, markers, crayons, water, watercolor paint, and the printables that come with this lesson. What happens when you mix water with some of the materials you can find in an art studio? This time, we'll use art materials for our experiment. Use a crayon to draw on your paper. Draw anything you want. Now use some watercolor paint and paint right on top of the crayon. Watercolor paint is mostly water. What happens? Does the crayon mix with the watercolor paint? Try drawing with a marker, then painting over the marker with the watercolor paint. What happens? Does the marker mix with the watercolor? Use your experiment results sheet number two to record your observations. Let's think back to our science experiments and see if we can figure out what's happening in our art experiment. Crayons are made out of paraffin wax. Paraffin wax is similar to oil. Do you remember what happened when you mixed oil with water? Oil and water do not mix, and crayons and watercolor do not mix. Markers are made out of water and color, just like the food coloring in our first experiment. Markers do mix with the watercolor, turning the paint a new color. You are ready to be an art mix master. Use what you know about oil and water to predict what will happen when you mix your materials together. Try drawing with crayons, markers, chalk, pastels, or pencils and see what happens when you mix these materials with watercolor paint. You are sure to mix up an art science masterpiece.